The German-based company Hobby has over five decades of experience making campers. The reputation of German engineering seems to be very important to them, and to live up to that, they know they need to branch out. That's one of the reasons they made Beachy. It's an affordable line of mini mobile beach houses on wheels with only the essentials included. The goal of Beachy is to create beautifully simple, stripped down campers that allow you to bask in your campsite scenery for an affordable price. And for today's video, Beachy has cooked something extraordinary up with their newest addition to the family, the Beachy 540. Differing from its sibling camper trailer models, the BT540 is the first camper van in the lineup. Using the Citroen jumper as a base, the aesthetics of the BT540 are inviting, with a light and bright design that opens up the interior space. The interior features a white and tan sand-colored palette, inviting you to relax and unwind. Fabrics inspired by the warm expanses of the sea and embossings to match adorn this comfy van. The overhead cupboards you would usually find in a camper van like this are replaced with no-frills retention straps. Like the driver and passenger seats, the second row seats include swivels, and next to them is a dining table that can be doubled as a bed. The Beachy adds another row of seats by reducing the kitchenette to a sink, a slide-out gas cooker, and a fridge. Another lounge area is found in the rear, complete with a removable folding table and a couple of benches. Double the lounge areas, double the lounging. While it is odd having two, it does allow you and your family to fully enjoy the scenery at any beach or mountain spring. You can transform the rear lounge area into a double bed at night for double the beds. The Beachy 540 accommodates five and sleeps up to four, but if you have children with you, you can probably fit all five in the beds. Somehow, even with two lounges and sleeping areas and a reduced kitchen, this sandy soiree still manages to pack away a portable toilet in one of its bench storage boxes across from the kitchen. Suppose you want just a bit more with your Beachy 540. In that case, an assortment of additions, such as an awning, are available for additional purchase. If you like the idea of an affordable, seashore-inspired camper, but maybe you prefer your pickup truck over the van, then other models in Beachy's lineup may be more up your alley. Every model features a similar design to the Beachy 540's tan and sand decor. They also include a 10-gallon cool box, mood lighting, and screen doors. The Beachy 360 is the cheapest at just over $16,500. It comes in at just over 16 and a half feet and features a flexible lounge area with a sofa that can be converted into a cot. The 420 model is a bit more expensive, with a price tag of just under $18,000. This model is around 18 and a half feet and was made with small families in mind. It can sleep two adults and two small children or one older kid. A small kitchen and a walk-in wardrobe with a mirror are coupled with this model. Finally, the 450 model is available for a little over $19,000. This model is the longest model at just over 19 and a half feet and was made with multiple friends and families in mind. It can sleep four adults or families with a few children. Also, if you have a large group over for dinner on the beach, the dining area features a table that fits eight people, so you can banquet on the beach. You might call it a concept, but the company built a prototype, so there's that designation. Feel free to debate that one in the comments as you see fit. When Heimer designed the Vision Venture, they chose to forego the standard conversion kit, instead building on a heavily modified Mercedes Sprinter. The rear houses a lounge area that has twin couches on each side, flanking a dining table that folds down and lowers telescopically, then retracts under the seat to offer a clear floor space between. This area can be expanded and opened to the elements by raising the large panoramic window and lowering the gate to create a small terrace. And 4x4 is built on Mercedes-Benz Sprinters. It comes in three different trim levels, the Classic Mode, Stealth Mode, and the Beast Mode, which we discussed earlier in this video. The Classic Mode 
has a flexible floor plan and a lithium-ion battery system that will give you sufficient power for your off-grid adventure. However, the Classic's 2021 upgrade will not have as many utility-related add-ons as the highly anticipated Beast, a production version of Storyteller Overland's pre-existing Beast Mode van. The Stealth Mode offers many conveniences that do not negatively impact your space. Going off-grid is excellent with the Stealth. Okay, we couldn't decide on just one Pleasure Way motorhome. With nearly 30 years of experience in the industry, Pleasure Way has really honed their craft and they present us with a solid line of vehicles to choose from. The Recon 4x4 is an adventure van capable of charting new terrain, all while keeping you comfy and content. One of the most interesting aspects of the Recon 4x4 is that freshwater storage was one of the biggest concerns when engineering this compact camper. And it is because of this that the Recon 4x4 sports 40 gallons of freshwater storage. Continuing on with the storage theme, the Recon 4x4 provides 124 cubic feet of storage. America's poster child for recreational vehicles, Winnebago, has been a leader in the industry. From RVs to campers of every kind and make, they know what they're doing. The Revel comes in at nearly 20 feet long and is their top RV debut in 2021. It has two 125 amp hour batteries, which are excellent for the hydronic heating system and ensuring that the two people the Revel can sleep are as comfortable as possible. Underneath the power lift bed is a gear garage, and next to that is the all-in-one gear closet and wet bath. The dinette has been reached. If you enjoyed this video, you could help us out by hitting the like button, subscribe, and keep up to date on future posts.